Are you looking to buy a house? Are you going to get a loan to buy that house? If you'd answered yes to those two questions, then this is the video for you. Because today I'm going to talk about how the interest rates affect your monthly payment. I'm Lindsay Johnson, your resource for all things real estate. When you're buying a house and you're going to be seeking financing for a loan, it's time to talk to the bank and figure out what your mortgage is going to look like. And interest rates are going to play a big part in that. How do interest rates actually affect your mortgage payment? Well, what you want to think about is when you go to a bank to get a loan, they're going to spit out a number for you. Well, the bank is loaning you that money and as wonderful as some banks are, they're not going to loan it to you for free. So the amount of money that you are taking out is going to be paid back with interest with a little bit extra to thank them for giving you the money up front. Interest rates affect your monthly payment because it affects your premium. And what your premium is, is it's the monthly amount that you have to pay the bank to pay your loan back. On top of that monthly premium, you're going to have an interest charge. So let's say they give you a loan for $200,000 and the premium is $800. That doesn't mean that's what your mortgage payment is. Your mortgage payment is the premium plus interest and oftentimes they'll roll in taxes and insurance as well. So it's important to pay attention to those interest rates because it can affect how much money you're having to pay for your house each month. Interest rates vary over time. If it's been a while since you've bought a house, you may notice that interest rates have changed quite a bit. In fact, in the 80s, you were lucky to get 11%. Now the interest rates are hovering in the high twos, low threes. So even if interest rates tend to creep up a little bit, the good thing to look at is the entire picture of history, knowing that if rates go up to three or 4%, historically, they're still some of the lowest rates we've ever seen. So there you have it, interest rates. They go up, they go down, they change. But the big thing is to know where you're comfortable and what you can afford. Thank you for watching. If you found value in this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And if you wanna know a little bit more about what the pre-approval process will be like when you're getting a mortgage, be sure to check out this video. I'm Lindsay Johnson, your resource for all things real estate. I'll see you next time.